Well, we have a lot to celebrate. I couldn't have signed on to the dot account without your help. Why? Yes, please. Listen, the dot account wasn't the first time you helped me, and I certainly hope it won't be the last. You've been an amazing colleague, and even more, an amazing friend. To us. What the hell was that? What? What do you mean, what? You just ate your glass. Well, yeah, it's a nice restaurant. What does that have to do with anything? I mean, we're in a nice place. It's, it's kind of customary. It's customary to eat literal glass? Yes. Julie, are you feeling all right? You're acting weird. I'm acting weird? Yeah, you are. Why are you acting like this is so weird? Because it is. That's not normal. You're not supposed to do that. What are you talking about? If anything, you're supposed to be doing it too. What? I mean, look, I wasn't going to make a big deal out of it, but I take you to a nice restaurant and you won't even try it. You want me to eat glass. Well, I'd like you to at least try it. I mean, I'm paying for dinner. It's really the least you could do. <laughs> You're messing with me. What? <laughs> you know, you really had me there for a second. There is no it, Julia. I'm not doing anything. Yeah, sure you're not. Why would I? What's in it for me? I mean, I take you out to a nice restaurant, you act like I'm crazy, you refuse to do something that's common courtesy, and now you're saying that I would trick my friends into doing something that would hurt them? You realize how horrible that makes me sound, right? God, why did you do that? <laughs> me? You're the one who told me to do it. God, okay, I'm gonna get help. Just, just stay here. How are we doing over here? I... He... That's not possible. He just... Ma'am, this is a high-end restaurant. And everything and anything is... possible. 